Samboanga City is the capital of the Samboanga Peninsula and is located on the eastern coast of Mindanao. With a population of over 1 million people, it's one of the most densely populated cities in the Philippines today. The city has many historical sites to visit and explore, including churches and mosques if you're looking for something new or fun to do while visiting Samboanga City. And one of these places to visit is the ZSCMST Bird Sanctuary and Mangrove Park. This is ZSCMST Bird Sanctuary. The ZSCMST Bird Sanctuary and Mangrove Park was established by the Samboanga State College of Marine Sciences and Technology to promote and preserve ecotourism and aquaculture. The sanctuary is a 25-hectare wetland located in the heart of Samoanga, which is a perfect venue for bird watching since we won't have to travel far to see the birds and introduce them to students and visitors. The sanctuary is a home to a variety of mangrove species as well as 53 identified migratory and residential birds. Tucked within the Samboanga State College of Marine Science and Technology, just a stone's throw from Fort Pilar and Paseo del Mar, the bird sanctuary is a haven for nature lovers, particularly bird watchers. The vast mangrove-fringed pond is a protected area, where great white egrets breed and thrive. Other migratory birds also frequent the site. designated view decks are accessible for those who want to spend some time here. The best time for birdwatching is early morning or late afternoon, while the best months are November to March. Great egret were commonly known as common egret, widespread and fairly common across the globe, this is a large, lanky, long-necked white heron. Occurs in any shallow wetland, including ponds, marshes, and tidal mudflats. Often seen singly, but sometimes gathers in large numbers where food is plentiful. Students and other bird enthusiasts alike find joy in sightseeing as they explore the diverse ecosystems and learn about the intricate relationships between birds, plants, and their environment. Gray heron. Plumage mostly gray overall, with paler neck, Moorhen sometimes called marsh hens is a medium-sized member of the rail family found in aquatic environments. 
It is 12 to 15 inches in length and has a wingspan of a little under 2 feet. It has gray-black feathers and a red bill with a yellow tip. It has white stripes on its sides. It has long chicken-like toes that help it walk on the top of floating vegetation and the mud. Males and females are similar, but males are a little larger. Purple heron, large heron with rusty head and streaky neck, juvenile is extensively rusty brown on upper parts. Favors fresh marshes with tall reeds and other vegetation. Often retiring then gray heron and rarely seen in open situations. Only likely to be confused with larger and bulkier gray heron, which is paler and grayer overall, with a stouter bill. Gray heron, plumage mostly gray overall, with paler neck, adult has white crown, black eyebrows, and black shoulder patch. Generally quite common and consipitious in wetland habitats from marshes and tidal flats to small ponds, ditches, and wet fields, nests colonially in tall trees. <laughs> 